Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. If you're running Windows 10 and Windows 11 and have an NVIDIA-based system, then just to let you know that NVIDIA has recently rolled out their latest GeForce game-ready driver, 576.02. And this is actually quite an important driver update because... It makes a couple of changes that I think would benefit Windows users, especially Windows 11 24H2. Now, first of all, at the beginning of this month, I let you know that NVIDIA driver 572.83 was causing black screens on Windows and there was a workaround in that. I'll leave the video linked if you would like to go check it out, where the game ready driver causes a black screen during the installation process after the, a reboot and in the middle of games. Check the video out for more information. Now, as mentioned, this latest 576.02 Game Ready Driver carries a couple of important fixes. And in regards to black screens, if we head over to the release notes and we just look for fixing gaming bugs. Yeah, you'll see a couple of interesting things. Now, the black screens were mainly affecting RTX 50 series. And here we can see GPUs crashes with black screen underflow. So there's a black screen that's been addressed. Random black screen issues. Random black screen issues. There's another one. System hard hang with 572.16 driver loaded. Here's another one. GeForce RTX 50 series GPUs crash with black screen when playing graphically demanding games. So you can see there's a lot of RTX 50 series black screen issues. So according to the release notes, this latest driver 57602 has fixed the black screen issues that we spoke about previously in that video. So as mentioned, quite an important update. Now something else is that if you are running Windows 11 24H2 or are wanting to upgrade to Windows 11 24H2, then what I would suggest is install this driver first before upgrading to 24H2 because it does fix issues pertaining to Windows 11 24H2 and if you are running 24H2 already and have an NVIDIA-based system, then apparently according to the release notes it addresses issues for windows 11 24 h2 here we go stability issues when using windows 11 24 h2 now that's all the information nvidia gives us but apparently there are quite a lot of under the hood fixes rolling out for 24 h2 where according to reports the driver is making 24 h2 run a lot more stable and also, it's improving the overall performance if you are running an NVIDIA-based system. So, so if you are experiencing issues with 24H2 and are running an NVIDIA GPU, then maybe this driver would be a nice move in the right direction just to sort out a lot of issues, according to reports, that are affecting 24H2 if you are running an NVIDIA system. Now, if you want to download the driver, Obviously, you can use the NVIDIA app if you have that already installed or you can download it from here. Or you can just download it from the direct download link and I'll leave this page um, in the description for easy access and reference. So just doing a follow-up fixes black screen issues and could bring a lot of um, stability into 24H2 if you are running an NVIDIA-based system. So let me know in the comments if it does address those issues. I'd be interested to know firsthand from viewers of the channel. And as I always say with uh, driver updates, don't always install the latest, greatest driver just for the sake of installing the latest driver because drivers can cause a lot of issues. So I only suggest installing drivers if you are experiencing any issues that the driver is resolving or it's bringing a massive feature upgrade, obviously, that you'd like to get your hands on because a lot of Windows issues are caused by drivers. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.